Welcome back. As the days of summer are winding down, we need to get ready for some changes in seasonal food. But there are still some ingredients that are perfect to use right now. Chef and owner of Exwa, Emmanuel Langlade, is with us in the kitchen today with a dish that is perfect for the end of summer. Some Correct. amazing ingredients that you have in mm -hmm. front of us today. What are we making? We're going to make uh, quinoa, kale, and vegetable salad. Quinoa, so a very healthy dish. That's right. That's I right. I love it. Okay. Organic and everything. Oh, very organic. Okay, you know. now starting with quinoa, how do you prepare quinoa so it's not it's the right um, texture well it's a uh, it's pretty easy you you, know, you either way uh, boil some uh, water or stock mm -hmm. and then as your water of course you have to uh, make sure that you have the right quantity according to the uh, the quantity of the quinoa that you're gonna uh, cook mm -hmm. and when it's boiling you put your quinoa you put uh, a lid on the top mm -hmm. cover it and 12 minutes 15 minutes later it's done it's done done like finish, this. Finish. You don't have to strain anything. It's done. And then we can add amazing ingredients. Where do Absolutely. we start? So uh, today we're gonna we're gonna mix uh, the quinoa with the um, organic black kale. Okay, black okay, kale, which is ahead. very Put healthy. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. And then we have different types of ingredients, like you know the mm -hmm. carrots. Okay. There you go. Sliced. And these are all raw uh, raw ingredients. Raw, okay. raw ingredients. Absolutely. Okay. We have also the radish. Okay. okay. So Michelle is going to mix the whole thing as I'm putting all the ingredients. Cucumbers. We have some edamame as well. You know, I roasted some earlier some uh, pine nuts. There mm -hmm. you go. It's a lot of ingredients here. It's going to be a right. big salad for you guys at lunchtime. <laughs> I love it. Um, red bell peppers. Some uh, tomatoes, here you go, not too much. Now, how do these flavors come together with the quinoa? Well, uh, well all the ingredients are going to mix together. We're going to mm -hmm. have the vinaigrettes, and mm -hmm. when the vinaigrette is done, you know, you, you have your and mix everything together. Now, you're going to add a little spice there. Spice, it's jalapeno. Jalapeno, guys, Ooh, guys, no seeds though. You, no, no seeds, no. <laughs> you guys need some jalapeno a bit. And then some fresh tarragon. Okay, some, tarragon. Some scallion. Mm -hmm. And some Italian parsley, here you go, a little bit. Okay. Voila. Voila. We're, we're gonna put some salt. Okay. You know, I like salt, so here you like go. I like salt too. Some black pepper, there you go. And then while you mix that, I'm gonna mm. do the vinaigrette. Okay. Then we'll add. So, two spoons of um, mustard, okay. Dijon mustard. Um, voila. I'm gonna grab my lemon. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna squeeze my lemon with my. Mustard. How does the citrus mix with the mustard? Uh, it just nice balance of flavors. Yeah, exactly. It, it brings some. Uh, mm -hmm. well, well, the mustard is kind of a, a little bit sweet and mm -hmm. spicy. The lemon will add some uh, um, 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 sourness, mm -hmm. which is good. Okay, and, and then, then you're gonna add some olive oil to that as well. I'm gonna, I'm gonna add the uh, orange as oh, well. Oh, orange as orange. well. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so it's more citrus, and this is really an easy um, recipe for folks at home. It is. It mm -hmm. is. You know, and the good thing is, you know, you can always. Now I'm gonna add my olive oil. Okay, as I'm mixing my mustard and my citrus. You know, with that salad, what is nice is you can add anything you want, like, mm -hmm. you know, goat cheese, feta cheese, oh, yeah. um, mozzarella cheese as well. But what we do at the uh, ex uh, at both of the restaurants, actually, downtown and the Brookside, mm -hmm. we do, uh, we add some uh, grilled salmon and some oh, grilled um, chicken, and that, re that makes a really, really nice salad. Uh, filling for lunch and everything, you know, because sometimes when you get a salad, you say, oh, am I going to have enough or not? So mm -hmm. if you had you know, salmon or uh, some uh, fish, I mean, uh, chicken, it's nice. Here you go. You oh, see? So we put it right Beautiful. Up, and then we mix the whole thing again. And your salad is ready. And it's ready. And we'll it looks put a bit more salt. A little more salt. <laughs> there you go. Top it off. And some pepper. Oh, this is perfect for this time of year. Thank mm -hmm. you so much for stopping oh, by. Welcome. If you want to uh, to try out this quinoa recipe, uh, we'll have a uh, link to Chef Emmanuel's recipe on our website, kclive.tv, later on this afternoon. Thank you so much You're for joining welcome. us. Thank I can't you. wait to dig in. Yeah. Let's <laughs> toss things over to Michael, who's talking technology.